What's up, it's your dude Eric Seats, next great drummer. I want to stress the importance of creating activities in the community. Drummers, uh, we know that the music programs have been cut down dramatically in the school. What we're here to do is get these individuals back involved in their passion, and this is in the form of drumming. Standing here with Lupe Duncan from John Muir, Pasadena, and I'm gonna let her break some stuff down to you. I'm doing great. Um... I started back in the 70s playing. Yes, I, I was the first female at John Muir High School in 1976. It just took me to a whole nother level of, as a person. It started a passion in me that still burns to this day. It's like, I don't know where I would be without not playing. It, it'll take you to a whole nother level to where you, you can reach your own potential that you might not have thought you had, okay? It took me two years to get in. They wouldn't let me play. Uh, I had to go back and learn how to read music. Also, the, the sticking, I mean, the, the style that they played back then was unbelievable. If you would come out and see us now, it's, it's, it's a sight to see. We play, yeah, we play, we play uh, like the rambling style. We have a slow style. We have, we have different styles, and it's good for the community. Kids, it's back when I played. I was the only one. Now it's a lot more girls to play. The guys need to step up because the girls we're taking over. You know, we need some more guys in there to play. You know, come on out and, and shoot. I'm here, Mark. I'm here with the next great drummer, and um, they're showing us new avenues on how to create even a bigger drum line than we have now. But I'm an alumni drummer from 1977. And I've been participating with this drum section and keeping it going for the last, you know, 30, 40 years. We don't have a lot of ways to go. We have no funding, nobody like that, so we do our own funding. So what we're trying to do now is get a lot of people more involved in it, you know. And that's where and, um, NGD comes in. We're about to make this happen. Yeah, and, and we're, we appreciate it. Oh, you know, we appreciate that, and uh, we want to take it to another level. Our biggest event is the Rose Bowl, is the Turkey Tussle, and we'd like to expand that, you know, to a 300, 300 group uh, uh, drum line. So if you want to be a part of that 300, 300 group drum line, you need to get in touch with us by our website or whatever, and we'll, we'll make you into the next great That's right. Drummer, next know? great drum line drummer. That's right. Come so. on, show your face and bring your A. This is a great avenue. Let's get active again. Peace. All right. What's up, NGD fam? And, um, I was the first girl drummer at Elliott, and they wasn't trying to have me on the drum line either, but she inspired me being over at John Muir and put it down. Uh, but Miss Loopy over here continued to be uh, the, the top female drummer over there at John Muir, and I kind of traded in my drums for a uh, skirt. So, that's cheerleading. Awesome. We hope to see you on the next great drum line. Peace. Standing here with Mr. John Pat. John Pat is an actual, he's an alumni player from from John Muir, Pasadena. I ask you, would it? What are some of the differences that you noticed from when you were playing in today? What's missing? Uh, in the past, the discipline, uh -huh. the dedication, and the loyalty. Back then, you know, like, uh, I used to watch the drummers in the late 60s. Uh -huh. And um, when I came up, got to of age, I played drums in junior high school. Uh, I did go to PHS and played one year. I was an alternate. But then when I came to Mir, I made the drum line. We had a hell of a structure. We had a, a strong structure. But the beauty of it is we all came together to practice every day, and it was a motivating factor. Make the drum section. Uh, well, we kept the tradition going. We have we've done uh, parades, uh, reunions, and we just get together and play. Yeah. Trying to keep it uh, motivated for the next uh, drummers. That's right. You know? There you have it. Very important to keep this thing alive. Drummers, if you're serious about what you do and you're a drumline player, you might want to participate. I'm a drum alumni association. And the, and the contacts are on there. So, yeah. as drummers, let's let's do this. Peace, peace, and we out.